13signsastrology.com how you guys doing tonight so we talking about top flight technology that um was was like incorporated into that old device that I was telling you guys about that I supposedly lost and it had like what's called like 5G technology installed on it and uh, like the 5G, 5G technology, those people, a lot of people don't realize that that technology is like the technology that's similar to the technology that I speak of that's used to essentially make humans into what's called like a biological computer or something like a, a biological form of an experiment. <clears throat> See, it's similar to 5G technology, and what they do is that they interface it with a higher G level. So when you talk about like Earthlink and companies like that, they'll understand what I'm talking about. But essentially, the Earth itself, even past just Earthlink, the company, but I'm saying the Earth itself, the planet, is essentially connected to a G level. Like some people say it's connected to like a... 8G level supposedly like hypothetically I'm not saying like literally 8G but I'm saying hypothetically if we were 5G beings they say the 5G technology was based off of our powers as beings you know before we lost this knowledge and they say that this earth when I say they the you know the scholars that are a part of like the higher theosophical orders like in the higher esoteric orders where a lot of this information comes from teach that the earth is it vibrates to the number eight and it's connected to some form of a like 8g technology and they talk about how to access the eighth chakra you would essentially have to first connect with the technology of the earth so this is why we know nothing of you know our higher chakras past seven because a lot of times when we do our rituals and that's what i'm going to get into on the next episode and start talking about rituals like sexual rituals and not even just sexual rituals but even money rituals that sometimes we don't perform properly and things of that nature because we don't have a connection with the earth meaning that we do rituals inside in buildings and things of that nature indoor especially out east see people out west they kind of know what i'm talking about when it comes to ha having a real pure true connection with the earth like a lot of the occultists out west and um, see how east we're connected to these buildings so we our culture how we deal with the call and channel and energy is slightly different because these buildings are really locked into our our auras and our vibrations in order for us to get free from a lot of this we don't have to cleanse and cleanse our vibrations and our auras and break away from the negative grid so that we can you know get on a more positive octave to get in touch with this higher technology this 5g technology so, um, yeah, like the 5G technology was actually installed on that computer. So, like I said, what I did, and it was a blessing to be able to understand even how to do this. When the computer was lost, I was able to kind of essentially track it. I was able to track it. And I was able to monetize it through whoever had it or whatever they was doing with it, whatever the case may be. I don't even consider it stolen. But it was just lost. Let's just say that for now because everything was rectified. But, um... So since it was lost, the only thing I had to do was essentially track it through blockchains and incorporate it through various areas that the computer was located at. And I'm now able to turn this into similar to a grid. So when you watch like Terminator and you hear about like what's called like Skynet, I'm going to essentially what I'm going to try to do once I finish this website. I'm telling you guys I'm working on a website. I'm going to try to do it through a phone, so bear with me. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to work. And if it doesn't, I was blessed to my followers and things of that nature, and the bank even was blessed to free up that those funds, a lot of those funds, and I think you know everyone that participated in that, so I can go ahead and get a device like I've been talking about. So either way, I'll be able to get a device. And when I get this website up, I'm going to incorporate it, kind of like a, a, a interweb, based on all the places geographically that I've been, and I'm going to be able to monetize through those places. And not only that, people will be able to monetize through me. They have YouTube channels and things of that nature. It's gonna, this is automated. It'll automatically generate and create more monetization in a bigger bubble, essentially, so that um, 
we can get out of this situation. So what I plan for it to be is, is the computer is going to be like Mercury. See, Mercury, and I'm going to get into this too more in the future, is a supercomputer. That's what people don't know. And a lot of the planets came from Mercury. And a lot of what we think of as Earth is actually computer parts coming from a bigger supercomputer that's connected to Sirius star constellation, other star constellations. And this is really how we got here. So like in understanding the dark web, this shit is gonna get fascinating. People that got blockchains and part of cryptocurrency you know what I'm talking about, because we will eventually be able to, to, to chart our story and to document our story how we got here. So it's pretty deep. I think my airtime is gonna run out. So again, thank you guys for listening and watching. I'm gonna come back up with more on the supercomputer. And as always, you guys stay vigilant. Namaste.